Whether you're staying and eating in an apartment rental or just need to pick a couple of things, shopping in Paris can be a bit intimidating. Things are different and there are different places. And if you don't read French, reading labels can be confusing, even daunting. So in this video, we'll show you what is available, where to find it, and how to survive shopping in a French grocery store. So Colleen, are you ready? I'm ready. Allez, on y va. Let's go. If you forgot your toothbrush or some other item, you can find those things in a grocery store. But the labels can be a little bit confusing, but they do carry many U.S. brands, and you'll be able to find your way through that toiletry aisle. But don't expect to pick up over-the-counter meds, like an Advil or an Alka-Seltzer. You won't find those in a grocery store. You're gonna need to go to a pharmacy for that. And you can find clothes in the grocery store, so if you forgot to bring a sweater or need a pair of slippers, you can get those in the store as well. France is not into the snack culture like we are in the US, so you won't find all the crackers that you're used to. But there is a huge selection of potato chips with some amazing and unusual flavors like mustard and pickle, poulet roti, which is roasted chicken, and funky spices, and they are all delicious. Now, you're not gonna find the crackers option in supermarkets because, you know, they have amazing bread. But you'll also find lots of saucisson or cured meat with some in bite-sized format so you don't have to have a knife to cut it. Those are great to have in a bag in case you need a protein boost while sightseeing. And if you need like sliced cured meat, you'll find lots of options of assorted selections you can use to make sandwiches or for a picnic or for a charcuterie board. And if you're staying in a rental apartment, you may want to pick up some ready-made foods. And most stores offer a really nice selection of both frozen and non-frozen but refrigerated options like pizzas and other meals. So you don't have to cook and clean up the kitchen after a day of sightseeing. In a French supermarket, you're gonna find all sorts of assorted soft drinks, including the famous Orangina, orange soda, and of course, Coke and Coke Light, which is Diet Coke. You also have a large beer selection. For blonde or lager, try the Lef. And if you want a little bit more flavor, my favorite is the Goudal. You'll also find tons of very affordable French wine and champagne. Now they also have hard liquor like rum, gin and vodka in all supermarkets in France. And it's very unlikely that they will ask for ID. Nobody cares here. One thing that is awesome in France is that they'll often have half bottles or smaller bottles of wine, champagne and liquor, which makes it very convenient if you don't want to buy a whole bottle of gin. Coffee and tea are easy to find in France, in cafes and even in the grocery store. But sugar and cream, are a bit different. Bags of sugar are more for baking. The sugar for your coffee and tea will be in cubes, like think one lump or two. And you won't find half and half, but they do have cream and tear or legere, which are gonna be close to what you want for a coffee cream. And they'll tell you what percentage of fat they have, mostly about 30%. And you can find the cream in the refrigerated section near a long row of yogurt options, but you won't find the milk there. Milk in France is in the dry goods. And for breakfast cereal to go with your milk, you're gonna find a lot of options that you recognize and that's easy to figure out.
Now the cookie in the candy aisle is one of my favorite in the supermarket because this is what I missed the most when I lived in the US. You'll find all kinds of cookies from all different regions of French which are delicious. Some of those cookies can also make a great souvenir present to friends and family back home. The candy section is also very different with candies you can only find in France or Europe. The caram bars are my all-time favorite which come in all kinds of flavors but the caramel flavor is absolutely awesome. You also have an amazing chocolate section in most supermarkets with all kinds of flavors and size. These can also make up for a great gift to a friend. Even though you'll find bakeries or boulangeries all over France with amazing bread, the grocery stores in France also have bread sections. And there's a couple of reasons why that could be interesting to you. One is the pan mi, which is sliced bread, also known as American bread. And that's great for sandwiches or morning toast, but also baguettes if you don't think you're gonna finish the whole loaf, because a baguette you buy today will be hard tomorrow morning. There's no preservatives at the boulangerie. Now, of course, the butter and cheese section in the French supermarket is huge. And they'll have a large selection of all the French classic like Camembert and Brie, Comté and Saint-Nectaire. Now, most of these cheese in a French supermarket are processed and a bit industrial. But if you're looking for the fresh stuff, it would be best to go to a fresh market. Now, we created a video on the top five fresh markets around Paris, and I put a link in the description. So check it out if you need some of the fresh natural stuff. The butter selection is also very diverse. We don't cook with the same butter that we spread on toast. There's also salt butter, demi sel, which is half salted and no salt at all. Make sure you get the one you want. And if you're not sure, President's butter is always a good bet. If you want to buy an apple or a banana in a marché or in a little side market, that's going to be easy to pick up a fruit and buy it. But if you're in a grocery store, you'll need to put it in a bag and weigh it or the cashier will not process the purchase. You'll need to find the scales in the produce department and follow the touchscreen icons and pictures. And you'll likely have a plastic sack and you can see whether it's fruits or legumes or vegetables. Just search for what you want and the machine will give you a price ticket. Bananas are bananas, apples are palms, grapes are raisins. And to understand the prices, they measure in kilos and one kilo equals about two and a half pounds. And finally, if you're looking for food-based souvenirs, that's a great place to buy them in a grocery store. You can find cute little specialty things, chocolates, cookies. Some people bring home foie gras, pâté, mustards and things. So it's a good place for you to find some little souvenir items to bring home.